Hey all Dustin Schaefer here, the Keto Pro. We're gonna talk about the holiday seasons. How do you have fun? Number one, how do you have fun? Maybe lose some body fat or at minimum maintain. The average person gains 15 pounds of body fat throughout the holidays. So we're gonna teach you how not to do that. And it's gonna be three simple steps. But there's gonna be a simple trend. Is the number one trend is you have to have fun. So the first thing you're going to do is on, on the days that you know that you're going to have a little celebration, not a cheat day, but a celebration day, what you're going to do is you're going to use this amazing tool, Keto Nat. You're going to use this amazing tool. What I want you to do on the day that you're going to have celebration, now there's going to be a handful of those days throughout the holiday season, right? It's not just a one-time thing. It's, it's multiple. Let's call Thanksgiving or maybe a holiday party. So what you're going to do is you're going to, on that day, what I want you to do is I want you to sandwich your ketones. So you're going to, before you go to the holiday party, you're going to drink your ketones, right? You're going to have a whole serving about an hour before you go. When you go, you got to go and enjoy yourself, have fun. Enjoy yourself and have fun. That's the rule. You have to go have fun. You can't think about all the restrictions emotionally. You got to go there and have fun. If you're going to indulge a little bit, indulge, enjoy and have fun. On the way home, I want you to have another one. Now, we've got caffeine and caffeine free, but I want you to have another one on the way home. So you're going to sandwich it. You're going to have it before and after your celebration, your holiday party, your fun. The next thing you're going to do, this is really important. For the next three days after the holiday party, I want you to increase your keto nap by one serving. So if you normally have two a day, I want you to go to three. If you normally have one a day, I want you to go to two, just for the next three days after. So when you wake up the next morning, you're going to have a keto nap. You're then going to have another one in the afternoon. Why are we doing this is that what happens is that when people go to holiday parties, first off, the guilt that you, that you carry, stop it. This is, this is a basically a way to protect you, still get results. And remember, I got two more videos that's going to help you accelerate some fat loss if you want to do that. So watch those videos. So have the keto nap in the morning. And then what it's going to do is it's going to reduce the sugar and carb cravings that you just had from the night before and those temptations to want to keep eating for four or five days in a row. And then have another one in the afternoon. And it's going to buffer it and keep it calmed down. Well, within three days, you're kind of back on track. You kind of figured it out. You're, uh, I'm back under control. And you can keep moving forward in the direction that you want to go. So that is the first tip that I'm going to give you. But there's two more videos. you got to check both of them out because I'm going to give you the other two tips that are extremely important, like how to eat and how to exercise. Cheers, y'all.